Good morning. Today you will be taking Unit 9 vocabulary test. So please make sure that you put your first and last name on top. And let's get started. Okay, question number one. Marley couldn't find a date for the dance, so he decided to go A. Absurd B. Solo or D. Vivid. Number two, here's a blank joke. Why did the monkey fall out of the tree? Because he loved pasta. Your answer options are absurd, anxious, or mythical. So was the joke absurd? Was the joke anxious? Was the joke mythical? Number three. Troy's sense of humor is blank to mine. We always laugh at the same thing. Identical, combined, or thrifty. If they always laugh at the same thing, is her humor identical, combined, or thrifty? Question number four. I had the most blank dream last night. I woke up thinking I was being chased by a pack of bees. So what would you describe the dream if you woke up thinking that you were literally there? Was your dream purchased, hardy, or vivid? Number five. I wouldn't say Morgan overeats, but he definitely has a blank appetite. I wouldn't say Morgan overeats, but he definitely has a blank appetite. Is his appetite hearty, thrifty, or combined? Number six. What would someone purchase at a circus? The vocabulary word is purchase. What would they purchase at a circus? Would they purchase a tent? Would they purchase cotton candy? Or would they purchase clowns? Number seven. Which of these phrases would most likely be at the beginning of a myth? Vocabulary word is myth. So how would a myth begin? By somebody saying, once upon a time... Or would it begin like this? Do not try this at home. Or would a myth begin like this? I pledge allegiance to the flag. Remember, a good test-taking strategy is to put X's next to wrong answers and M's for maybe next to correct answers. Obviously, guys, that is totally not the correct answer. So this is just an example of a test-taking strategy. Let's move on to number eight. Which of the following is an example of the word anxious? B, a student worried about his parents seeing his report card. C, a principal punishing a student for skipping school. Or D, a coach making his players run laps around the football field. Which of the following is an example for the word anxious? So if you're anxious, are you, um, is the student worried? Is the principal punishing somebody? Or is the coach making his players run laps around the football field? Number nine, which person would you expect to be thrifty? Who would be thrifty? An actress who stars in a movie. So these actresses, they have a lot of money because if they star in movies, um, they've made a lot of money from every movie that has been developed. C, a zookeeper who just got a race. Or D, a student who pays for college by herself. Now, college is very expensive, guys. So if he's, if this student is paying for college by herself, 
um, they must be able to take care of their money because they don't have a lot since a lot of it's going to college. Number 10, to combine two things, you might A, separate them. So we're talking about combining. Do we separate them? Do we mix them together? Or do we think about them all the time? Okay. Make sure that you answer all your questions. A good test taking strategy that I use is uh, question, answer, question, answer, question, answer. So I put my fingers on the question, so like number four, and I find the answer. Five, five, the answer. That way I know I've got ten answers all together. Okay, and then um, turn it into the top orange or green tray whenever you're done. If you had trouble answering a specific question, you can go back on the video and try to find where I read it so that you can listen to it again. Good luck, guys. Have a good one. Bye.